happy Friday. It's Black Friday, day and after Thanksgiving. Today is the day where everybody does all their shopping and so we are actually headed to Disney Springs to show you guys what Black Friday looks like at Disney Springs. Well, We've never been there. Also, I wanna see that sweet drone show. Oh, well yeah, and that. <laughs> but here is a look at the traffic on the other side of the road. This is everybody headed away from Disney, I think? Yeah, we're on 536 right now. Did you happen to look and see if any of the stores at Disney Springs were like doing any Black Friday sales? There are a bunch that are doing Black Friday Friday sales, I did not like pay close enough attention to see which ones were actually doing it. Oh no, he didn't pay multiple attentions to see which one was doing it. And here we are going to the most magical place on earth. There's a bunch of signs that say no stopping. Oh no. All right, this is our first update for our Black Friday shopping at Disney Springs and it looks like we may not be able to find parking. Yeah, that's not amazing. We're like in dead, not dead stop traffic, but pretty pretty like bumper to bumper traffic. And where do we need to go over there? To the left. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Do you think, oh God. What? Do you think all of this traffic is to get into Disney Springs? I think some of it is. Mm. I don't know why, but I didn't think it was gonna be busy for some reason. Like I figured it would be like a little bit busy, but not like this. Not like this. We're getting closer to uh, the actual entrance to Disney Springs, but I wanted to show you there's characters in flight down there. We are pulling up to the uh, little parking garage signs and it says there, I don't know if you can read that, but the Lime Garage is closed. There was a sign earlier that said that surface parking was closed too. That is not a good sign. <laughs> yeah. I knew it would be busy, but I really didn't think it was gonna be this busy. They have cast members parking at Typhoon Lagoon. Oh no. Yeah, is it isn't good. Mm. I hope we actually find a spot. I think we'll be able to find a spot because it's pretty late. Actually, you know what? If anybody worked today, they're just getting off work. So maybe this is like the worst time. Yeah. <laughs> All right, we are in. We made it. Going to the Orange Garage. That's not exactly where we wanted to go, but it's the only place that I think we're allowed to go at this moment. There's 68 on level two. Level one. Oh gosh. On the ground, I don't know. We found the spot. Look, we're in it. There's the crowd. It doesn't look as bad as I thought it would, but there definitely is a crowd. Definitely has the hustle and bustle of like a big shopping establishment. Gotta admit, Planet Hollywood looks a lot better at night than it does during the day. So we're in the main like shopping hall. What would you call this? This is Town Center. This part that we're in specifically is called Town Center? Yeah. Oh, okay, so we're in Town Center. I didn't know it was called that. Like this covered area is called Town Center? I think so. Oh, okay. Well, we're in here and we're looking to see what all the deals are, but I haven't seen anything yet. Have you? I saw one sign inside of Columbia that was like Black Friday. <laughs> but we don't know what the deals are, so. I don't know, but it is pretty crowded. There are 50% off select styles in the Sperry store. The only thing about that Sperry store that I don't really understand, and I think we actually said this the day that they opened, they don't sell the Jaws shoes. What's up with that? I mean, I get it. It's a Disney, like, area that we're in, but they would make so much money if they sold the Jaws shoes. It should also be noted, there is a tree lighting ceremony and I just looked on the app to see when it is. Uh, there's nothing on the app about times for anything in Disney Springs. So uh, when you get here, I would pick up a map because it'll probably tell you there. Is this the line for pictures in front of the tree? I don't know. I think it might be. Here's the Christmas tree all lit up. It's real nice. I like it a lot. It looks really good. All lit up at night like this. Here's what those weird crystal balls that we found before look like when they're all lit up. They're really pretty. Yeah. I like how big it is. So last time we were here too, there was a stage over there that is not there anymore, which I thought was for the lighting ceremony. Maybe they don't actually do the lighting ceremony anymore. But also there is a photo pass photographer over here taking people's photos in front of the tree. Disney Springs really looks awesome, all lit up and decorated like this. Just imagine if they put the Osborne lights in here. I don't think they're going to. I don't think they could. But just imagine. I don't think that Disney would put them in a place that they are not charging you to get into. Right. So they're not gonna put them in here. Right. They wanna charge you as much money as they can. And they right. can't do it here. Over by the tree, we found this new store called D Living, which is a Disney lifestyle store, I guess. It's like for home goods. It just opened though. Yeah, let's go in and check it out. Look at these awesome, awesome Disney things. It's very cool. It does not feel like a Disney store in here at all, but it definitely is. Is this supposed to be a copy of the clock on Cinderella Castle? Because they got the numbers wrong. This Beauty and the Beast China. Look at that. Look at Lumiere. And it says, be our guest. I feel like this is all stuff that we already saw in the Christmas store, but just displayed nicer. 
These look just like all of the stuff on Etsy. Oh yeah. Oh, look at this wreath. It's a little fake fireplace for you to sit down and like think about Santa. <laughs> I like these frames within frames. Actually, I thought that was a cute idea too. That's interesting. Yeah. Oh look, there's me. Hi everybody. And that's it. That was the whole store. There's not very much to it. What'd you find? Oh, oh brother. <laughs> we came over to the poutine stand because I heard they have specialty holiday poutine. There it is. It's holiday turkey poutine with turkey, gravy, french fries, cheddar cheese, and cranberry relish. But if the holiday poutine isn't your thing, they still have the Classic Latin, Italian, and French poutine for you to try. We were passing by Uniqlo and I noticed this whirly gig window. It's pretty intense looking. It's like mesmerizing. Last time we showed you guys paddlefish from kind of far away, here it is up close. Right next to the gelato place and across from Morimoto's, you see these walls here because we're going to get a wine bar here. It's gonna be called Wine Bar George. And I guess the George guy is a big wine enthusiast from Orlando. I just saw this sign for the Edison bar. It looks awesome. I cannot wait to see what it looks like when it's done. I'm trying to find a good spot for the drone show and uh, there are a lot of people waiting here. Right, we have our spot for the drone show. We don't know where they're gonna be, but look at all the people waiting for it. I'm pretty excited for the show. I am too. Yeah, we're like right behind us is like where the food trucks normally are and then Starbucks is right there if you're familiar. Right. Um, that, so that's where we're at. And but. hopefully it'll be good. I think it's supposed to be like a three or a five minute show. So yeah. there are definitely a lot of people here waiting for this show though. Yeah, it's pretty crowded. Yeah. So I thought people would be here to shop, but they're here to see the show. Yeah. yeah. Should be noted, there's 20 minutes before, there's still 20 minutes until the show and uh, there are bugs all over the place out here. Like I'm, I'm covered in bugs. <laughs> a little bit of a breeze tonight and you can see it in characters in play. Look at how much it's moving. Oh, holy cow. So they just turned on all of these blue lights across the lake. That must mean something. So that's Saratoga Springs. It actually looks really pretty with those blue lights. Maybe it's gonna start soon. And so it looks like Characters in Flight is down for the moment because they will not go up during the drone show. We invite you to gather around the Disney Springs lakefront for a very special holiday experience. Star Bright Holidays and Intel collaboration will begin in just a few minutes. So the boats are out there. I don't know what they're doing. Welcome to Disney Spring and Star Bright Holidays and Intel collaboration. Now, join us and look toward the stars. Five minute show and then uh, probably the worst traffic trying to get out. Pretty intense. Turns out Disney Springs was not really set up to flow correctly after a show. I like how they're playing like a really heavy version of the cranberries. This is intense. Yeah. So 
just so you guys know, there's a bridge right there that looks awfully crowded. We're gonna go this way and go over by the Coke store and through Town Center to get over that direction because it seems like less people are going this way. And there's also wider. Here's the front of what will be the Planet Hollywood Observatory. It looks like terrible. <laughs> I feel like it's gonna be a lot cooler looking when it's done. I hope so. They didn't, you can see the stars still on the inside. They didn't repaint or do anything to the outside. They just covered it with like a tarp. This is all new over here, but still they just covered the dome with a tarp. So Characters in Flight is back up and there's Edison. And golly, I really hope that we get the Neverland Tunnel. How cool would that be? Like, do you see these like little arches right here? Like. Does that not look kind of like... Well, I mean, we'll, I mean, Oh, maybe those are just pipes, but it, I wish that that was like the entrance or something. I don't know if it will be now that I'm looking at it from this angle, but I wish it would be. We just walked in a world of Disney and we noticed that there's a ton of Moana merchandise out and about. Kind of excited to have any of you guys ever see... Oh, look, there's the rock. Have any of you guys seen the movie yet? And what did you think of it? No spoilers. So every time you go into the Ghirardelli store, you get a free little square of chocolate and I believe they're giving away peppermint bark chocolate now. So we're in line to get some free chocolate. Oh, here's our peppermint bark that we got. Look at that, that's our free chocolate. I talked to a family from Florida and the littlest one asked me, he said, who's that on your shirt? Is that Perry the platypus? And I was like, oh, it's Darkwing Duck. I need to stop vlogging because I am in a very high traffic area. Look at this rocket, we're in 28 in Maine. Look at this rocket to the moon shirt. I love it. It's amazing. Also, this Rocketeer shirt. Also, this Adventurers Club shirt. Oh look, a hangar bar shirt. That's really fun. My favorite part about that guy is he's doing your face. <laughs> a splash pad that's not gonna go off right now but check it out all of the spouts are little mickeys all right i made a request to the dj let's see what he plays this is not what i requested We asked the DJ over there to play Christmas is starting now. He said, I'll see what I can do, and then proceeded to play this. <laughs> Not Christmas is starting now. Maybe we'll hear it in the distance as we walk away. Greetings, how are you today? Doing good, how are you? Good to see you. Very festive hair, miss. Thank you. Very nice. I appreciate that. Oh, very good. I, perhaps I could get a standard issue recoloring of my own hair. Yeah, you should. I would have to ask the workshop uh, for me. I feel like Santa would be okay with that. As long as it was- Is correct, it Santa? Right? You know Santa? Well, yes. Just checking in on the Santa uh, wait times. 150 minutes on Black Friday. Totally worth it. Look, there's Santa taking a picture with a baby listening to Cupid Shuffle. Do you guys want to hear a ghost story? What the heck is going on in this window? This kind of creeps me out. Look at her dead stare. Outside of the shore store, check out this awesome snowman. Not like a sandman, I guess. Ooh, sandman, right? The last stop of the night is gonna be Sephora, but I wanted to show you guys. Look at all of the lonely guys sitting out front, waiting for their wives to finish shopping. It's like just people sitting around waiting. Just passing by Blaze Pizza, and look at this line for all these people waiting for quick fired pizzas. And thus concludes in Oh no. <laughs> that concludes an excellent trip to Disney Springs. Thank you to, um, in the last meal vlog, a couple of you sent me some Sephora gift cards. So I used those tonight. Thank you so much for my birthday presents. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, so here's the thing. Disney Springs is very festive. Yeah. And it's fantastic. And I really feel like if you're looking to get into the holiday spirit, you should go to Disney Springs. Because you don't have to pay to get in. There's no park admission. You don't have to pay to park. You don't have to pay to get into Disney Springs. 
and you get to see everything like the tree trail all of the stilt walkers they're all just out there for you right there's music playing yeah there's drones it is not the osborne lights no. but yeah i feel like it's the closest thing we have right now that's kind of sad right <laughs> But I did like the show and hopefully you guys enjoyed it in this video. Yeah. And with that being said, we are off and we will see you guys tomorrow. And now it's time to pay the price. Bye. And of course the obligatory on the way out of Disney Springs. Uh, traffic. <laughs>